Welcome everyone to day three of this first test in the MyTeam11.com India Tour of the West Indies 2019. The West Indies taking on India here in the World Test Championships. The Sir Vivian Richards Stadium here in North Sound with India in the driver's seat and 297 which they achieved in their first innings courtesy Rahane and Jadeja with half centuries. Yes, I think uh, what Ishan did yesterday was much ball a much fuller length. That's something that he's been doing over the last couple of years. There is much fuller length. Uh oh. He'll get four of them. Won't hurt India too much as a... Nicely done. It'll be another boundary. Well, the 200 for the West Indies comes with that boundary and it's 202 for eight. Nicely played. Stood up tall. Made very good use of his height. We've seen him play that shot. Pulled away. Very nice from Jason Holder. He stands tall. It was a length delivery. Oh, is this gone now, though? Jammy strikes in the end. Persistent line and length. And it's not coming to go as it's hold up. In this replay, just searching outside off stump, and then we all know Sammy he does have this getting out delivery. Got it into the right channel. I think uh, Holder was just looking basically to steer it down past, past uh, the second slip, third man. That's exactly what he's tried, and it turns out that maybe defending the ball was the right idea all along. Good bowling from Jadeja, thrown up, little bit of turn. You had guys who got in and didn't quite uh, capitalize on what was happening. Well, here we go. There's the scorecard for the West Indies, the first uh, first innings. The bowlers for India, exceptional stuff from Ishan Sharma. Five for 43 from 17. Jasprit Bumrah was good. Didn't get the just rewards. One for 55. No run, no run. Short and four. Well, 22 overs and now finding the outside edge, falling short of first slip. I'm not quite sure. Might be a seam of friendly surface, so get prepared, guys. Two runs. That will take the players off the field for this, this short session of batting for India. Seven overs, 14 runs. To Cummings and Holder showed heart. That's one thing you take from the West Indies session this morning, which was pleasing to see. An average of three runs per over. That should put them in control. That will be their first target. So far, they've started nicely. Wish has an opening, batsman. Oh. Nicely played. That's a shot that he enjoys playing. It's not square of the wicket, he's placed it fine. Something being applied. Holder replaces Cummins. Beautifully played. It's one of the things you, that fascinates you about KL Rahul. The, the ability to play with such finesse. A real touch player. Should be close, must be close, surely, yes. Because that looked plumb. It's a full length ball. And he's missed it. He's probably decided to play that way before that ball was bowled. It was much quicker, in fact, and much fuller. Could have easily been driven. Oh, that's a good shot down the ground. Very full from Gabriel. Raul needs no further offer. Punches it straight back past the big man. Oh, this one's slightly short. Raul waits for it nicely. The late cut. Will it go for four? Oh, yes, it will. In the match today. I think one of the things for me, Murali Kartik. 
a boundary. Got him. Another attempted sweep. When you keep bowling there, you're always attacking. Even though a few shots might be played of you, just uh, playing over it and moving too far across. Nice off the back foot. Pujara getting more and more fluent with his stay up the crease. Got him! What a beauty! He's been persisting with that delivery, going away from the right-hander. This is worth seeing because the bat and pad is generally together. Oh, what a beauty! This is an absolute beauty from Kemar Roach. Yes. Cut away. Strong wrists from Virat Kohli. We'll get a boundary. That's a nice shot. Shoulder arms. Virat Kohli for the final delivery of that over. And that should be T. Two important wickets for the West Indies. The other going to Kimaroch. Well, they come after T because uh, I do believe that not bowling Roach and Gabriel immediately after lunch when the ball was hard and new was a mistake on 14 Rahane also looks as if he's carrying on from the first innings again Ajanka Rahane very comfortable to stand back catch him oh, dropped it went in the leading edge uh. Oh, he'd be disappointed with that one. Oh, it's a cracking cover drive on the up through the offside from Rahan. Beautifully played, a little bit of width from Shannon Gabriel. He needed no end. Oh, this is four more. Short and wide from Gabriel. Hammered away from Rahani. And everyone got so many runs on it. Nice cover drive. Half stop to extra cover, but I think that'll go all the way for four. Yes, it will. Half century, second of the match for uh, Ajinka Rahane. Well, before the test started, there were some who were questioning his place in the team. Well, he's answered it in the most emphatic manner. Just pretty high, and I guess whenever you uh, beat Virat Kohli's bat, it always creates some sort of uh, excitement. Yeah, pulled away, what a shot! That's a man who's well set, gets his half century, only his second boundary of his innings. single yet again brings up the hundred partnership between these two pretty good again as you can see uh... last delivery and the last over I presume for the day's play goes down the leg side Shannon Gabriel, two buys. And yeah, as expected, the umpires will call play. The way in which Virat would have played uh, today and Rahani. Credit must be given to Akimo Roach. I think he was a pick of the West Indian bowlers. Any team that is in the position that India is in today at the end of play would be quite happy. That's the position that, especially when you are in a test match. Well, India started the innings with a lead of 75. They've taken that to 260. The West Indians, they got three wickets in fairly quick time, you would say. 
India batting first, getting to 297 and then restricting the West Indies to 222 in their second time at the crease. India, 185 for three.